Hey there, welcome back and thanks for joining me. My supplies and equipment are listed down below in the description box and most of them have links, so check that out. And if you'd like seeing this video, hit that subscribe button. If you want to be notified of future videos, hit that notification bell. Okay, let's get going. I have got pinata, mentala black, and I've got the pinata blanco blanco in this container here. We're just going to have fun. All right, so what I'm going to first do, and of course I've got the Tim Holtz blowing tool. Uh, I want to call it the blower thing, but it's not the proper name. So I am just going to do, huh, you know what, I'm just going to, I'm just going to do. So, all right, let's go right here. layer on me. There we go. One drop to about two. Okay, let's see how that does. Ah, that's better. This other one started, I was afraid it was going to travel too far. You know, I'm going to start over because I like that. I don't like that. So, there we go. That's how you do it, right there. Let's start over. One drop. Two drops. Now it's as far as I want it to go. So I'm going to kind of, just kind of get it dry. Because I think more than two drops went down. I mean, one drop. One. Now I am trying to fan this out a little bit. Great, but this is a little different bottle to than the Ranger. I sometimes get a little stumped on it. One, two. fell short. So I'm going to do it again. And you know it may go off the top. I really don't want it to, but it might. That's a lot, and I know it. Okay. There 
There we go. Woo, save that one. All right. I love all these. This one's still dark, so I kind of want to go back and just put a drop there. And a couple of them. Um, because I want that one a little lighter. Not that. So let's do it again. That's too much. All right, let's do this. I never can see if this is coming out. I'm sorry. It is. With it being black and then this bottle not. Okay, I'm about to just. Should have left well enough alone, but I want to see if I can't get it. There we go. Whew, almost gave up, and I like that. Okay. I'll let that dry. And maybe one here, maybe one there. Is that too assumed? I guess, but I'm doing it. Boy, if you don't get that mixture just the same, it does so different. Three drops came out and I can't, I need to get the two. You know what? Let's see how it turns out. We may like it. It may be good to have something a little different. Telling these Blanco, you've got to make sure on your bottles they stay cleaned out because they clog up. This is my third bottle to put this in because it just keeps clogging. Oh, that one just poured out. Well. Thank <laughs> you. 
I've gotten quiet because it is game on. I am, <laughs> I am having a hard time. This is a little more difficult than I thought, but that gum I'm gonna, I'm gonna learn it. I'm gonna get this figured out. Who'd have thought black would have been hard? Or at least hard for me. I do love the fact that you can go over it again. to get right there. Jeez. Two. One, two, and three. I don't even care that it's light. Yes, I do. I want to do that again. Okay. No, 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 because we're going to put white in this. You know we're going to put white in this. This needs longer over here. If nothing else, I'll scoot the center over because I don't know. I can't get it to go. All right. So, wow, this is so different. I don't know, do I want to put little ones here or put some greenery? I kind of wanted this just black and white, but I'm thinking it's not going to be as cute as I want. Um, yeah, I am. So, where's my go-to? It's moss. And little tip, so oh my goodness, that's a little easier. Kind of makes me think about putting my pinatas all in these with these needle nose. But I hate to do that. Alright, so of course there, there, there. Oh well, let's just let's just start going. But you know, the good thing is, is this has got that, that milky look, so it does go well. So that, that's good. That I'm happy with. That I think is a good thing. I'm going to put this one right here and blow it that way. If we want to cover that, we'll do that with a brush. Just hit some things in there. Like that, you would assume it would come through right there. So we'll do that. Um, okay, I'm going to do one coming this way. Um, I'm 
we'll do one here, one here, and then one there. And I think that's going to be it. And I hope this is not going to look so structured. It's not what I was going for. But, you know, I, who knows till we get to the end. Good grief. I love moss. Oh my word, that is my new favorite. All right, I want that darker, so I'm gonna do it again. Dead gum. I hit that. So that, yeah, pretty happy. And I don't think I mind the white. Um, I do want this up here done. So looking for my bottle caps. See if I already have one with some green in it. Yes, I do. That's got green. And that is the moss. No, I'm not going to use that. Yeah. Here, I'll just use this one. All right, so what I do and it's like this is I just put a few drops in here. Account for your brush, going to suck it up. So I try to put either equal or a little more. And then I just kind of Come in here and dab. There. And that's spreading out, so. And see, you'll never know. That's just kind of put in there. Um, I'm squinting. See what I can see. I do want this filled in. See how you can't even see that. Uh, this. All right, I need to stand up and look at this through the camera. See what do we see. And that's a great way to look at your stuff. Is go take a picture of it. For some reason, it helps you to really see better than you're just sitting right over it. This right here needs that. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking I need to do something in that middle. Um, not all of it, just some of it. So I'm all that if that came down like this, that's going to take up some here. And then this one, let's say it did this.
You know what? Cover it all up, Eloise. You know you're going to. Okay. Yeah, I wanted to leave some white, but I'm just not that brave. Okay. So there's that. All right, I need to figure out what I'm going to do for the centers, but in any case, I need to either use some acrylic, white, or the Bombay ink white. It, but in any case, whatever I use on it, I need to spray it. So let me go spray it with the Kmart, and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got it sprayed, it's dry, and i got my bottle cap. Keep these, these are great for just those prompt, impromptu like palettes, you know. I have a palette for my inks, but um, this will dry permanent. Alcohol will reactivate it, water will not. You know, I just do this, and that way when I either keep these and do it again, or I toss it. Uh, if I can get two uses out of something, I'm pretty happy. So, um, I've decided on the Bombay White India Ink. Um, pretty much for the reason is I don't have it in liquid acrylic. So, my choice got real easy real fast. And, you know, I've had, I've had good luck out of it. I only used these once or twice. And my grandson has had a blast with them. He got to use them the other day. Okay, so there's that. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what I'm going to dab it with. I wonder if that's dry. Let's see. I got these little bitty tiny pipettes or whatever you call them. And, uh, no, nope, it's got green in it. So... People give me weird stuff. That doesn't work. Let's do this. I just want to put it down. Um, I don't really have a preference on what I want it to look like. But something with some texture, seeing as this isn't going to have really a lot. I don't even know that this will dry. It may dry flat. Who knows what it will dry like. And these are little dotting tools. They come five of them, all different size ends. I'm gonna move the center over this one. The center's right here, what I was, was trying to do. But my flower came out lopsided, so I'm just scooting it over. When you do stuff like that, your viewer will not question it. They'll just take what you offer them and go, oh, okay. Interesting thing about the inks, I was playing and I thought that the inks were permanent, were permanent, were permanent. And they are with water. I took alcohol to rub over it because I wanted to do something a little staining with an alcohol ink <laughs> it took it off so yeah they are used like watercolors when they're dry they are permanent water will not reactivate them um, with alcohol they work with alcohol colors they play well with everybody and once they dry alcohol will reactivate them but not water 
yeah, I'm going to play some more because they're, they're intriguing. But, so this is my center. And let me get it dry. Um, I will probably put some black in it. I might put an inkling of yellow. But, you know, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm going to leave them. I'm going to put a little black to them to shadow, you know, get me a shadow area. And these are the two colors I'm working with. So, let me get these dry. Okay, these are dry. All right, so... Let me make sure I'm squared up for you. Um, black marker. I'm going to use the chisel side. Look how dirty my hands. Good grief, i got paint all over my hands. So... I need to decide which way the flowers look, and they all kind of look like they're, this is the only one I can really say it looks like it's going that way because of the shadow and the light here. So, um, if it's going that way, wow, I just went blank all of a sudden. I could put darker and make it look, yeah, that's I think what I'll do. That chiseled in was leaving some major marks. I hope that's right. It wears me out when I do the head of it that way, but obviously it's going that way and it gets a little confusing. So I'm just going to stick with this, kind of, and put the bottom here, just because I think we're pretty much all comfortable with the flower going that way. squint and believe what you're drawing then you're good to go all right I have to squint or you know take a picture of it look at it it's amazing the stuff that after I finish I take a picture of it and then I think oh there's like six things that I gotta fix great way to double check yourself All right, so I kind of have a fun idea to put the little stippy st I might just do that. I don't know. This is fun, too. Okay. I'm doing this regardless if I do any black. If I did any black, it would be on the green. So this is how I play. I decide. I'm doing this all over anyway. It might be that I stop there. It might be that I take a picture of my art so I at least have a picture of that stage. And then I do black on just the green leaves. And I put the white stamen stuff, that whatever those little things are, they stick out of a flower. Um, <laughs> and believe it or not, I was a master gardener at one point. So anyway... Um, yeah, I can't even think of things. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do the white, and we'll take a picture. And then I'm going to do the black, just because I'm curious. I'm wondering what that looks like. And then I'll take a picture, and then I'll put the little white things in here, and I'll take another picture, and that way, if I don't like it, I know where to stop next time. And I know why I stop. I know why I would do or not do the same thing again. So... 
do little things like that and you learn what you like, what you would have done different. So there's the lecture of the day. All right, so again, I back off so I will be a little more free. Um, so I'm going to make this one big leaf, this whole thing right here. So I'm going to do this. And my pen's not working. Okay. There we go. Not great. I think I'm getting out. Oh, sad. And then I've got... Yeah, I think I'm going Where's my big one? I think I'm going to Yeah, I may have to just do this. Is that too big? All right. Again, I'm going to look through my camera. No. I think the big one will do fine. Yeah. So, that's fine. Um, my little one's, I guess, playing out. I need to get some more. This one is over that one, so we'll do it first. This one, I don't know, just do something. Okay, this one, that one, then that one's on top. still may do the black. I, I think I do. I think I want to do the black. So, again, let's finish this and I'm going to take a picture and then we'll continue. Now, a lot of these lines dictate where I'm going to put petals. Like this one right here. This is going to be a cool one. And I don't do all the petals. You may want to do the left side of all of them or the right side. It's just, I'm not going to do it all because I don't, I don't want to be obvious outline and I want to leave my person that's looking at this a little, you know, a little fun. And a lot of these will call it themselves. You don't have to. I do not even know what that was. That was yucky. Um, and you can decide what you want to do here. You can do all of them. Or just do a few. I do a few and then look at it. And I may want to go back in. And, you know, like this right here was another line that I didn't originally do. So like that, that, de that determines one. And there. And this one looks like it's going over. 
but then so does that. Now I'm not coming to this. I need to I need to do that and get some of these down to where you, the flower connects. And I don't want to do too many of those because then they just become <laughs> become lines that get you confused. So you don't want to do too many, but here and there you want to do. But some of these will have to go all the way to the flower, or they'll just they get they get lost. Okay, all right. Well, that's pretty interesting. Seems like a lot of white, so I am definitely going to do the black on there, and the little white thingy. So. Let me see if I can take a picture filming. Oh, you can. That's cool. Perfect. All right. I can keep going. <clears throat> okay, so if I'm going to do that, let's go ahead and put the little whitey things. Just indicate you've got the little things, the little stems. And you want to come from the white area. Yeah, I like the small one better. And those would be really cute with light yellow on the end of them or something like that. Okay, we're done with white. <clears throat> Grab my black. Now this is just on the green. I wondered. Now, something I didn't do, I put the white more to the outside. If I was going to do the black, I should have put the white more to the inside. Not any reason other than that's just what I do. Uh, it's it's There's no right or wrong on this one. But I generally put the white on the inside of the outer lines. So... But you know, I don't have to stay in the green, so I can come out and do that. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, oh, ooh, I like this. Looking at my camera. Take a picture. Wow, okay. Uh, not quite what I went for. In general, it is, but I thought I was going to have a different look. But, wow. I thought the black would be just black. There would be nothing to it but this white. And, again, don't know why I didn't figure this out. The white is awesome in that. Okay, I'm going to get off here. I've kept you long enough. Go try this. It's fun, and y'all go have fun.